why we have to consider this? Because when you joined in biology, you might have been some sort of interest. Even while preparing for the MBBS, also you got a certain inquisitive towards the research and to know more and more things. So this is a good platform originally that the students want to go for higher studies and uh, research, especially in terms of those who are having the biological sciences, probably you know the it is directing the, the way we live, this particular course or this particular discipline, because whatever the life, if you know, after the discovery of the structure of DNA, people come to know that the life is nothing but a simple chemical. So subsequently, when chemical process tool of inserting a heteroatom into a, a cyclic molecule, and similarly, inserting a gene into another uh, uh, host uh, life with DNA. So it has made the recombinant DNA technology in 1973. So since then onwards, the change has been taken place in the biotechnology, though the term of biotechnology first published in the year 1917, but it has been known only after 1973 with the uh, commercialization of recombinant DNA technology for the production of insulin. So that is the reason just people come to know it is not only a simple technology, it is convert the adversaries into opportunities and also a foe into a friend. How, why I would like to tell that it is a foe into a friend? Because you know about the tobacco. So this tobacco is a very high large surface area leaf and it is prone for a kind of pest known as tobacco mosaic virus. So to remove that particular pest, we are adding certain pesticides and also you know the tobacco is cancer causing. So that is when slowly the tobacco cultivation, earlier it is considered as a commercial crop. Now it is being uh, slowly being taken off because of ban on tobacco and other things, uh, tobacco products. The recent inventions, if you look at, the genetic engineering has helped to modify this particular test, the tobacco mosaic virus, into a genetic engineering product. So that is able to produce a particular protein which is going to cure the cancer. You may think that a cancer causing is converted into a cancer curing product. So which lives on tobacco. That is the reason it is considered to be a point of friend. And in addition to that, because of its large surface area, the somatic cell culture techniques which has been established in South Florida, University of South Florida, help to produce insulin. So instead of producing from a living uh, other organism, it is only a plant product is able to produce that particular drug. So this is the kind of advantage this biotechnology tools are being helped. So moreover here, this is highly an interdisciplinary enterprise and which consists of eight different disciplines, the career when you choose. First and foremost, you need to know about the chemistry. The second thing is you need to know the biophysics. And third thing is you need to know about the biochemistry. And fourth is the molecular biology and fifth is microbiology and then sixth is the genetic engineering and seventh is the chemical engineering and eighth is the computer science. So these eight disciplines knowledge is important when you are going ahead. And the syllabus is also structured like that the people will come to know what is a biotechnology. So these eight disciplines knowledge is helpful in uh, devising a eight different tools. Mainly one is recombinant DNA technology, another is uh, known to be a immunotechnology, the today's diagnostics, whatever we are considering about that. And third one is cell culture technology, fourth one is enzyme technology, fifth one is analytical techniques, and sixth one is computational techniques and seventh one is fermentation technique and eighth one is downstream techniques. 
So these eight disciplines are useful for learning about these particular techniques and tools. So these tools and techniques are classified into three types. Again, the scientific tools and the technical tools and engineering tools. Those who are very good with the biology can go for the scientific tools, mainly the recombinant DNA technology and the immunotechnics. So these are the unraveling the disease control mechanism, especially in the healthcare industry. So biotechnology further classified into three types. One is green biotechnology, which is mainly agriculture and environment, improving the crop productivity. The another is red biotechnology, which is known mainly concerned about the healthcare industry. And another or third one is white biotechnology, which is about the industry and energy. So these are the specialized areas when you go for higher studies, which will be focusing. And this is addressing mainly the five areas. One is the agriculture, second is the environment, and third is the healthcare, that medicine, and fourth is the industry, which provides the desired comforts, and sixth is the, uh, the fifth is the energy. So just without the energy requirements, those are the biofuels and whatever we are speaking today. So that is going to be there. So this uh, way, there are two types of products you can generate. High volume and low value products and low volume and high value products. So the high volume, low value products are normally the solvents, chemicals, mainly the uh, alcohol, ethanol, is citric acid. These are the things. So where the bulk production is required. The knowledge of fermentation technology and downstreaming is necessary. And similarly, when you want to produce the therapeutic proteins and diagnostics, which is in low volume, which even a microgram or grams or milligrams cost more than a lakh of dollars because they are useful for treating certain orphan diseases and uh, unknown uh, diseases. So that is the reason just uh, uh, this particular uh, recombinant DNA technology and immunotechnics are mainly useful. So the students who are aspiring to or having uh, to go for this particular career, so this is an alternative to the medicine, but it will supplement the needs of the medicine. And tomorrow, the, the, uh, beside me, the pharmacy professional is there. He also speaks about that. So because tomorrow, the pharmacy product also need to develop from this biotechnology. So all uh, biopharmaceuticals, insulin, if you speak about, vaccines, if you speak about, antibiotics, if you speak about, what are the hormones and so on, they are the products of biotechnology. Now, in the pharmaceutical industry, more than uh, 10 products uh, are known to be blockbuster drugs, and which is uh, generating more than a billion dollars per year profit for those particular companies. So this uh, new tools and techniques helping improving the health care, not only to the improving the quality of life of an individual. That is the reason the way what we live, it is going to affect it. So, the students who are having uh, aptitude for research and higher studies should opt for this. Future is for uh, agriculture because the growing population decreasing the land and demand for more food, not only more food in quantity, the food in quality. Number of opportunities for somebody has to explore, produce food from the and any of the technology. More than that, a uh, lot of communication and awareness training programs or train awareness among the farmers is also a field left over for uh, opportunities in different directions. So in agriculture university, we have different courses which deals with the soils, pests, management, and uh, related aspects of production oriented, nutrient, water management, so many fields. After completing four years degree, students can seek employment not only in government sector but also in private sector. I think uh, those who have come from the villages or those who have their parents or relation uh, doing agriculture, they may be knowing that nowadays private is dominating over the public sector. In the sense that they have opportunities. And the public sector is interesting in investing crores of rupees and uh, 
entering into business, there is a, a scope for uh, a business. When there is a scope for a business for somebody, there is a scope for others to get employment. And uh, so private sector, public sector, giving wide uh, chances for employment uh, in after completing the four years degree. And those intended to do further research as in other faculties and other fields, excellent opportunities for uh, PG and uh, PhD later on, so and so, uh, getting uh, very good uh, positions in the universities for doing research and uh, inventing some technologies for self-satisfaction and also for the welfare of the society. Because if we continue, a lot of uh, uh, wonderful opportunities to continue the education later on. In the same agriculture university, we have a four-year degree course in agriculture engineering. This is purely for mathematics students. Those who have completed MPC, uh, there is a possibility that uh, there is a scope for uh, agriculture engineering. This uh, field also, uh, let's just inform that uh, agriculture engineering nowadays is uh, getting a lot of importance for the two reasons. A lot of mechanization is going on in agriculture. Many people doesn't want, to, even the labor also doesn't want to work in uh, agriculture fields. Generally, the government also giving other uh, opportunities for them. Therefore, uh, most of the people are leaving agriculture, not farmers, but more the labor. Therefore, for agriculture mechanization, unfortunately in India, where the population is increasing, but the labor is becoming a shortage. And now, invention is for uh, implements and mechanization. Not only inventing a machine, but also how to use it uh, for a business point of view. I said that the business point of view, this mechanization uh, may give a chance for uh, self-employment or own employment uh, aspect together. This is a four years degree course. They teach agriculture a little bit and agriculture related uh, engineering, particularly mechanization, soil water conservation and irrigation techniques. This irrigation is now because become important because of the scarcity of water and the new methods of irrigation have to be explored, methods to use, therefore agriculture engineering. In this context, I would like to say that those who have completed for the last 10 years, 99% of the students after completing this 4 years degree are being employed, either in government sector or in private sector. A very good opportunity in this. In the agriculture university, there is another course, Food Science and Technology. This is the course which is not uh, attracted by many people, but it has got uh, engineering as well as science related. Therefore, 50% of the seats are for those uh, completing uh, under MPC quota and 50% for uh, those who are coming from YPC. This Food Science and Technology, they teach uh, science, agriculture science, food science, and also the technology related to the food processing. Uh, I would like to again mention here that food processing probably we are seeing in the towns, particularly our cities, a lot of uh, fast foods and also the temptation for the people to go uh, venture for uh, costly food or nutrient for nutritious food, food preservation, food processing, lot of other uh, techniques they will be teaching and a very good chance for here for the, those who would like to just uh, a business oriented attitude if somebody in the family or parents encourage the students to go for the future is there for this food science and technology. It's a four years degree course. So more than other than this, probably those who cannot get a seat in all these faculties, there is a lot of home science, particularly for girls. It is not only for girls, ladies, but also for gents also can join it. But uh, home science, in irrespective of the M set, those who depending on that 12th March, so there is a home science uh, four years degree course. They teach uh, all types of uh, uh, nutrition, food and nutrition, women and child welfare, textiles, so many other issues uh, they will be teaching. And there is a good employment either in the university or in the government sector. And the food and nutrition coupled with uh, so called the food processing, if it improves, probably a very good uh, uh, chance for employment. Uh, these are the four, three, four courses in agriculture. And uh, since agriculture veterinary were also with us, probably horticulture is a similar way of a four years degree course. Agriculture is, I mean, horticulture separated from agriculture in the sense that horticulture deals with, uh, we will be taught about flowers, flower production, fruits, vegetables, and related uh, crops. 
So the science related to these crops, particularly, will be taught in the, all the four years, regular uh, soil and so on. So. And here also is in agriculture, a very good uh, employment source in government sector. And also the people in food processing and uh, in the private sector also. And in a similar way, there is a chance for post-graduation, PhD, getting employment in uh, universities uh, uh, and so on. And veterinary, probably over and above these two, probably most of the students are preferring veterinary. May not be any other things, but just to get an easy employment. It was about about five, six years back that veterinary were complete. Immediately they used to get because a lot of vacancies available and government was filling it. But now other other departments are also equally opened up for the employment. So therefore, as on today, there is a. 100% employment guarantee, to say exactly, for the, those who are completing a veterinary course. That's a five years degree course. Uh, to say frankly, it's a little bit tough course. I would like to just, uh, because you have to deal with the medicine, almost medicine, uh, human medicine is a single uh, <laughs> species, but in veterinary, lot of different animals, different uh, things. Uh, uh, therefore, little bit anatomy, biochemistry. Many people who are just our friends used to go through the veterinary courses, and they used to struggle, we have seen, we have seen it. Uh, I think the students who have secured good uh, ranks, probably they may not be difficult to pursue, but the veterinary is a, a very good employment opportunity. Uh, probably these are the uh, courses available uh, in agriculture, horticulture, and veterinary universities. Uh, 